Okay, good afternoon folks. Welcome back. It's February 2nd, 2023. Today I'm going to be using <clears throat> my new brand new ProVap 18. Uh, we're going to be putting some oxalic acid on my hives. Um, got above 40 degrees here today, so I'm going to go ahead and try to hit them once or twice more here before spring build up. Um, trying to take care of some mites. So, if you're going to be doing oxalic acid vapors, um, a couple things you're going to need. The first is going to be uh, for your PPE as a respirator. You need to make sure you get one that does uh, organic vapors and acids. Uh, that way, if you happen to accidentally breathe in some of the oxalic acid vapor, it doesn't hurt you quite as bad. This one here is a half face. Uh, one a little better would be a full face. Um, that would protect your eyes and other things too. So you could uh, get them at your uh, local big box stores, things like that. They sell those. Also going to need the nitrile gloves. You don't want to touch that uh, oxalic acid with your fingers, so you want to keep keep your hands and stuff away from there. The oxalic acid, um, I bought uh, that on Amazon. can't remember how much it is, but that's 10 pounds. That lasts a really, really long time. And then lastly, I have the uh, ProVap 18. That's brand new. Uh, I haven't even used it yet. Just tried it out once here the other day. So this one's a little bit different. It's kind of uh, something brand new they came up with. Uh, takes a normal 18 or 20 volt battery for uh, your uh, cordless drills and stuff. The uh, version I have is for DeWalt since I had uh, DeWalt equipment. You can get Milwaukee and uh, Bosch and a couple others. Uh, on their website uh, the, <clears throat> One of the interesting things about uh, this piece of equipment here is uh, they have this plunger This plunger you just dip into the oxalic acid It's set for two grams So once you get it heated up You just push the plunger down That dispenses the acid into the uh, heating element right there and Then that vaporizes everything once we plug this in, or not necessarily plug it in, but put the battery in, um, the, uh, try to get out of the sun here, ProVap Pro 18 that uh, warms itself up to the correct temperature, and it kind of maintains it there. Uh, I'm going to say it's 235 degrees Celsius, so that uh, vaporizes the acid, and it doesn't take very long. It's like a minute or two before it heats up. And uh, when I did my test with the 2 gram, it takes about 30 to 45 seconds or so for everything to uh, vaporize and uh, you complete one round. So it's pretty quick. Um, in the past, I did have a uh, kind of a handheld unit with a hand crank fan. I had been using that for a couple years, but here a few weeks ago when I did it, the, the fan broke. So I decided to purchase this, kind of upgrade a little bit. Um, this company, they also have units that you can hook up to a, a generator or you can do uh, like a car battery style. But I decided to try this method since I have uh, the batteries and stuff. So anyways, I'll uh, set up the camera here and uh, kind of get going and show, show you what it looks like. Okay folks, so now we can see the uh, the unit has heated up to 230 degrees Celsius. It's ready to use. So we'll take our plunger. This is what the oxalic acid looks like. Push the plunger into the bag, and it loads it up good. So we're going to end up putting that down there. And I'll set the camera here. Right through the hive. And as you can see, it vaporizes instantly.
And as I mentioned, it takes about 30 to 45 seconds to get everything to vaporize and you're done. So it's a pretty quick process. Right now the unit's losing a little bit of heat as it vaporizes the dry acid. And it's quickly coming back to temperature once you're done. So right there, that's one hive done. It's a very quick process. So far so good. I'm gonna go ahead and do another one. We're just gonna work our way down the line. And the problem is that you know it will upset the bees. That's just part of it. Right now there should not be a whole lot of brood in the hives. It should be pretty birdless. There might be a, a small patch. But this should get a lot of the phreatic mites that are hanging on the hives or the within the hive. So just like that, two halves are done. And I'm going to keep working on down, but that's kind of what you do for mite treatments with this ProVap 18. So far it looks like it's going to be pretty quick, so looking forward to using it. If you have any questions, leave them in the comments. Thanks. Okay, so a brief after action report. Uh, pretty impressed with it so far uh, on the battery usage I had three bars when I started and it's only down one bar I've got 34 hives here probably took me 30 minutes if that uh, it's very quick to go from one hive to the next the ProVap 18 it warms up real quick so as soon as you're you see the temperature drop down it dropped down like 209 and uh, once it came back up to about 217 218 somewhere in there basically the vaporization was done and you're ready to move on to the next one so it's it's very quick like I said it's about 30 seconds 20 30 seconds per hive so far really impressed with it glad I bought it it is a little expensive if you only have you know a couple hives but you know, I've got uh, 70 hives, I think. So for me, it's going to make sense. It's going to be a huge time saver doing the vaporization. Catch you later. Thanks.